What's up Jones Bones? It has been a while since I have washed my face with the collection. Life just got hectic. Um, I ended up triggering myself about things and it was really based on this idea of have I forgiven my mom? And like, what is forgiveness? So um, if you guys want to let me know down below, what is your version of forgiveness? Um, and let's like really delve into that conversation next time. But like not today because I'm still on the rebound, okay? From that, we'll talk more about it later. <laughs> but um, yeah, so we're restarting this and we'll talk about something else that was on my mind, okay? And um... We're going to get into that right after this intro. It was at this moment that he knew. He f***ed up. Okay, and we're back. So I wanted to talk to you guys about something that has been on my mind. And it's like, what am I doing with my YouTube channel? Wait a minute, is my camera set up? Clean, gotta get me. Gotta get all of me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Gotta... Don't cut off the little button, okay? There's something there. Um, but where am I going with my YouTube channel? And the reason why that is on my mind is because I was like, I'm growing so much. People are watching my channel, but like, what what are they getting from me? Like, what are, what do they like about me? Are they going to stay? And I guess it's a fear of, fear of seceding. I think it's something that's holding me back along with, you know, the mental health aspects of everything. Um, I'm afraid. I'm afraid that what if I don't have what it takes? Oh, my face is still feeling really smooth though. Um, what if I disappoint people? And then like, how many channels do I see that's really like what I'm trying to do? <laughs> and then like, I was like really thinking like, how do I do this? How do I create content? This is something that I want to be serious about. This is something that I really want to do. I want to base my life off of being a YouTuber. I want to do these things. And how do I do it in a healthy manner that I can actually get success? Now, when they're talking about having a YouTube channel, they talk about like, oh yeah, you, you can't just, you know, do a bunch of things. And that's what I've been doing from the beginning. Um, and it's making me wonder if I should have just stayed on the the bra videos and stuff like that because I got a lot of hits from that. But then also I got a lot of hits from that from the wrong people. You know, I've met some people that will like hit me up. I even met a guy that will give me money just to, well, he was asking for videos and stuff like that, you know. And I was thinking, even thinking about getting into OnlyFans because, you know, I just want to say, smacks work, it still work. You know, I don't have any problems against that. Um, I had some people that were like, oh, one day someone's going to look at you and then they're going to bully your kid about it. And I'm just like, <sighs> you know, so that kind of put like a little bit of doubt in my head. But I mean, they're the ones looking at your mom, little kid. You know what I'm saying? So it's really interesting. Like one day someone can look um, me up and find my YouTube channel in which I talk about very openly about things that happen or I talk about certain things with about my husband and stuff like that you know someone's always going to see something about me that they're not gonna like right so why should I try to tailor myself for someone who I probably wouldn't even like to like me it's like a lot of thoughts going on so do I continue down this path of just doing me or do I stop for a moment? I don't know, but I want to continue to make the post. I want to continue to do this. I like washing my face. I like taking care of myself, you know? And I like recording it, and I like just talking. That is what I like to do. I like to talk, you know? And I think in my day-to-day -day life, I don't get to just talk to people I don't get to just share my emotions or share my feelings in a way that feels like someone actually cares about what I'm saying and when I post and when I record for YouTube I feel like at the very least there's one person that is interested in what I have to say there's one person that's like okay what we want to talk about today Leah you know there's there's people out there and that one person is why I keep making these videos. I like 
knowing that there's one person that's listening one person that's interested in what i have to say because growing up i felt like people weren't really interested in what i have to say people weren't really interested in me as a person right so like is it a little like trauma based my whole existence yeah i do want to become famous i do want to get to that level where i'm like trisha paytas and people just come to watch me just have fun or do this or try on clothes i want to be at that point where it's not just what am I producing it's not just oh big boobs the big boob girl of YouTube is also okay sh let's talk about her thoughts today let's also talk about this let's get into the spirituality today did I spit on you guys I'm sorry I'm sorry I don't know if that touched you or not I'm sorry let me know down below <laughs> um but I want to talk about so many things and like Oh, I'm feeling kind of like I feel kind of gross lately um, with the lady time of the month. It's like it's kind of strange. OK, like, let me tell you guys, if I find out if I get some news that there's a baby in this belly, y'all going to be the first to know. I'm going to just drop it in a video and ain't nobody in my family going to know. I won't even tell Stuart. Y'all know before Stuart because Stuart don't watch my videos. <laughs> but um, yeah. I don't know. I'm just like, how do I best do what I want to do? How do I best be who I want to be? My mouth was open for that. You know? I don't know. But, um... It's just a lot of thoughts banging around up here inside that head okay and it's saying girl figure your life out because nobody else is going to figure it out for you you know what i'm saying and then it's also like how do i better present myself how do i present myself in a way that people want to sit and listen to me and it's like do i continue being myself am i enough is what I ask myself. And it's just like, girl, you go in and out of being on YouTube too often to be asking right now, am I enough? Like, keep your consistency. You're ever growing, you know? People are watching your content. So it's not the time to question, am I enough? Because you are enough. Like, I'm hyping myself up, but I feel like I am enough. People like me, maybe, you know? Like, I think you guys kind of like me at the very least. Y'all like, okay. What is Aaliyah getting into? Like, I've been spamming you guys with the washing my face and whatnot. But it's simply because I've been washing my face every single day. Well, I was. I was washing my face every single day. And while I wash my face, I have something to say that I just wanted to share. And my thing is slick. I should have done it in a way where, like, every, like, for a month, I was posting every single day, day after day after day. But I started trying to uh, post ahead of time, which the posting ahead of time, I don't like how it makes my channel look like I went on the channel and I could see like, it's just like, oh, premiere, 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 premiere. It don't even show you the new videos that are already out. Like that's bothersome. I'm just like, okay, can I make it to a point where it hides the premieres and just shows the videos that are already out? And then when it gets closer to the premiere, it does that. YouTube, that's something y'all need to do, okay? Let my premieres not appear under my videos. Can it, it just be under a different tab called premieres? Like, can that be a thing? <laughs> like, cause I don't need my premieres under my videos, okay? If that makes any sense. Oh, I'm sorry, babies. I don't turn off the light. Like, I'm ready to go. <laughs> but anyway, much love and positive vibes. And I will see you guys later on tonight. We starting it back up. This is pretty much day number one. Starting it back up. Day number one. This is what my skin looks like. Let me make sure I show y'all the skin. Day number one, part two. I had some roughness come back from not using the product and I noticed some hair growth coming in and you know little pimples because it's about that time that time of what that month it might even be that time for but y'all will know like I said y'all will know when I find out bye